know that you, and you uh, you said that the weather is going to be pretty nice for East Texans. Yes, I think so, Nolan. So we'll have a few higher clouds in the morning, but I still expect some sunshine. It's a little later on in the day. It will actually kind of look like a hazy shade of winter, okay. if you will, because we're going to have clouds rolling in, maybe even a little bit of drizzle. But let's talk about today and the temperatures we saw first. This is the Tyler Almanac. 58 was your high, the normal 65. The record set back in 1913. That was 81 1972. That was a hard freeze. Look at that 22 degrees. That was not meant to be today. We were down to 36 this morning right now with the exception of a higher cloud or two in Longview. We are seeing clear skies. Temperatures have come down now 30s and 40s. There's the infrared giving you those higher clouds in deep east Texas dew points. They're still rather low, so we're well away from getting any rain with the absence of Gulf moisture. We just don't have it in the region right now and probably won't have it for most of the day. And it's thanks to this ridge of high pressure that continues to move off to the east. But once that thing moves into Louisiana, winds will be out of the south and that will allow more cloud cover and a better chance of some drizzle to move into East Texas. But if you're heading out tomorrow morning, maybe you're running a turkey trot or something like that. Just a few higher clouds around. But as we head into the afternoon and evening, there's your rain chance right there. Deep East Texas. It is a slight chance of rain. Rainfall totals will be well under a tenth of an inch. So if you see a trace of rain, you're going to be considered lucky tomorrow. Not a washout, not going to impact anything. As we head into Friday morning, Black Friday morning, a few clouds around, especially to our south again along the Texas Gulf Coast, and then we'll see clearing skies in the afternoon and evening before more clouds arrive out ahead of our next storm system late in the day Saturday. I'll talk about that in just a second, but I want to summarize your Thanksgiving day 45 at 9 54 at noon. More clouds, maybe a little bit of drizzle by six o'clock. We will still be in the 50s. Here's a wide look next disturbance that is up to our north. Let's go ahead and track that for you. We're seeing a little bit of a mixture in northwest Oklahoma. That's nine o'clock in the morning on Saturday, and then as we head into late Saturday, we start to see rain get a little closer to us, but here in East Texas, we're remaining dry for most of Saturday. As we head into Saturday night and Sunday morning, there's your chance of rain. The front is going to move through and we will begin to dry out in the afternoon hours for Sunday. So a couple of opportunities of rain there, but this weekend's rain chance will be the better one. Friday decreasing clouds. No issues for Black Friday. If you're still one of those that likes to stand in line, we'll be at 63 and then 62 for your Saturday and we'll extend this to the seven day forecast. A scattered shower possible early Sunday morning. We dry out Sunday afternoon a lot drier for next week, Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday, partly cloudy highs in the 50s. Nolan Carson, thank you very much. Well, coming up